drama of human experience. And that comes from uh, an article written in uh, Human Technology Relations from the University of Twint. Now, this means that technology isn't just a tool we use, it's a very active participant in our lives. So think about that. When I was uh, 21 years old, technology for me consisted of a 1967 Plymouth Grand Fury four-door with 900 miles that I got from my grandmother. There was no internet. There was uh, no smartphone. There weren't even cellular phones or flip phones at that point. Technology consisted of my car and I don't even know if you want to consider television technology, but that was my interaction with technology. In terms of coding, I took classes at school and in college on COBOL. Uh, I think, I can't remember what the hell that stands for, COBOL Common Oriented Business Oriented Language, something in that effect, where if you made a single syntax or spelling error, you were screwed with the rest of your program. So that was the limitations of uh, my interaction with technology in my high school and college years. Well, fast forward to today, we have smartphones, we have artificial intelligence, we have streaming services on our TV. Technology has rapidly advanced and has become so integrated in our lives. I haven't even mentioned smartwatches and virtual reality and you know the Oculus uh, headphone or uh, iPhone are the headphones or iPhones? I'm not really sure. But the Oculus gear that people can wear to experience uh, their world through uh, virtual reality and augmented reality. So how we use that technology is definitely um, important in the equation. 